What's up now, friends? I literally never vlog, so I might look up a lot. I, I don't know. Anyways, today I thought it'd be fun to go shopping. So, um, that's what we're gonna do. Let's go. Okay, so I am here at Michael's or Marshall's. Where am I? Michael's. Okay, so I'm planning to go to Michael's and then maybe Marshall's if I can't find everything that I can here. What I'm are, like really looking for is a crystal dish that I can use as a dappin dish because I've seen some people do that and I really want one. So I want like kind of like a candle holder maybe that looks like a crystal that you can put monomer in. So I want a few of those if I can find them. I don't know if they'll be here. I just thought. And I had a few other things I wanted. I want to change my background, so I want a different prop. So I was thinking some like flowers and stuff like that. I want some paper. So you can use them as backgrounds or I could use them for product shots. I'm just here to get a few fun things. So let's look around. Also, I'm gonna look at the crystals and the glitter because obviously I got you. So let's go. There's so much Christmas stuff and it literally smells like Christmas in here. It's Halloween today. <laughs> it's kind of funny. It's Halloween today and it's really, really Christmassy in here. Maybe I should be looking for Christmas props. I found them. So pretty. I obviously have to get some because I'm here. I don't really need much, but hey, I'm liking these shapes. Focus, damn it. Look, they have little shapes in the tops of these ones. It's funny, they make you see a sales associate just for a pack of crystals. Like, geez, people, stop stealing stupid shit like that. Making it harder for the rest of us to shop. But they have like, I was looking for like more big ones. Um, where are they? I just saw them. Oh, there's only a little bit of them. And these ones have holes in them. So sort of like for necklaces and stuff. Ooh, I like the colors in that one. That's unique too. I'm gonna have to get that. Also trying to keep in mind my Christmas series coming up. I used to use these big crystals all the time. I kind of like the kits marks. They come with like the three sizes and stuff. These ones are like small versions of the other ones I grabbed. I'm like drawn towards this because it's so pretty and hollow, but the problem with this it doesn't look good in videos. But look, they have these huge boards. These might be really good. Cloud one. Look, it's like a galaxy one. Would that be cool? I found some craft glitter here. It's really weird though, because they used to have so much more. This is definitely like dwindled down. Or maybe I'm just in the wrong spot. But look, they have like some chunky ones. I'm not gonna bother with these, I think I have enough glitter in my collection, but I thought maybe you guys would want to see it. Christmas, more Christmas. Okay, I think I'm getting to the area I want to be at. More glitter. I saw these little copper hearts, thought that was cute. Stars. I love like the little shapes. Look how big these are. Those will literally last you like your entire nail career. I don't know though. Sometimes with these ones, if they're like colored like this, they can bleed when you touch it with monomer. Okay, so these are kind of the style I'm looking for. Not sure if this is exactly what I want, but I need some sort of like flowers for my background. Cause you guys know on my Instagram, Sarah's Nail Secrets, I have like a white background. It's just plain white, but I'm getting a little bored. I do like having the white background, but I wanted to throw some like pretty textured flowers just behind, even though you probably won't even really see them, but it's cause I thought it would be pretty. So that's what I'm looking for. So I'll go back to that if I can't find really what I want. I might find that at, mm, no, it should be here. Okay, here's the paper books. These are what I was looking for. But I wanted something, I don't know what I want. This maybe, I like the wood, but 
I don't know if I'll ever get that much use out of all this. Too much. Oh, I like this perk though. I want these for like product shots for the nail thrown Instagram, you know? So it's not like a boring white background. Oh, this one has clouds and unicorns. Oh, that's cute. Ooh. I like that. <laughs> These are $29, so I'm really gonna have to pick one that I really like, because I don't wanna spend $29 on a book I'm not gonna use much, you know? Okay, though, something like this has 180 sheets, super thick. This is 29, or I could go with one that is 60 sheets. They also have individual paper for backgrounds. So they're sparkly and stuff like, like all of these. The sparkles are not good for filming though because um, then the background gets the focus instead of the nail art, which is super annoying. But if it didn't, it would be so great if just, see, even now it's doing it. It would be great if it didn't do that because that would be really pretty to change all my like video backgrounds to, to glitter. them the flowers I was hoping for more realistic looking flowers but like I said it'll just be my like very background of a set of nails this is basically what I was thinking like a few of these in the background but I don't know I might go for those other things that were quite flat the color is so fun like look at these but I created like a white background and I could change it, but I really like having the white background. Floofy fabric might be a good background idea. Those little ones I was looking at before, they're $7 each for one. I can't. Okay, so I just finished at Marshall's? Michael's. Why can't I remember that? They're too similar. I just finished at Michael's. I got a cool, a few cool things, and I'm gonna head to Marshall's now, or HomeSense, I guess. More like HomeSense, to get the other things I was looking for. So, I'll bring you guys with me there too, show you some cool stuff. Let's go. More Christmas. So much Christmas. Ooh, I love it. It is busy in here today. I'm loving the Christmas stuff. Okay, so I did end up finding flowers at the other place, but now I'm like, shit, are they gonna be better here? Because that sucks if they are. Oh, these are so cute. Good. Sleeping mermaid tails. Should I get one? See, this is cool because I do need something that spins like that for product shots and stuff. But it's missing a crystal. It's like, will that annoy me? Because then I could only like use half of it, you know? It's kind of big for what I need. If this was like a crystal, this would be kind of what I'm looking for, but you know, like a candle holder that's like special. Like that is exactly what I was looking for. Oh my goodness. Look at that. That's what I was looking for, basically this. Oh my God, I have to get this. Smaller version over here. That. I think that would be more practical. Hmm, should I get both? <laughs> I'm surprised I found them. I can't believe I found them. That makes way more sense, but this one's insane. I just want it. Oh, for what? I met a lady and she found me a second one that was the same size. So I don't have to go for these obnoxious size ones. As much as these are so amazing, um, I just don't know if they would fit on my desk. Oh my god, they're so extravagant though. At least I know they're here though, right? You can always, oops, come back and get them. I found more of these spinny things. 
I want a spinny crystal one. I'm in the iridescent mood and I just saw these. And I literally want them for no reason. Doorknobs I don't need. Done at home sense. Dangerously low on gas. Gonna get some and then I'll show you guys everything I got when I'm okay, home. Okay, so I'm home and I have this stuff here to show you guys some up close and what I actually picked up. So I went to HomeSense, like I said, and you guys kind of saw some shopping there, but the only thing I ended up coming home with was the crystal Deppin dishes that I decided to get. Oh, I was so excited for these. Yes, look how pretty they are. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I hope these work out exactly the way I imagined. And so I bought two of these, and the reason I bought two is because Anyone who knows me knows I'm super clumsy and I am sure that I will drop and break one of these. So I need to have two. And I know that they have those bigger ones, but I thought those bigger ones would not really fit very well on my desk, although it was super pretty. So if I start feeling regret, I'll go back and get them. But the reason I got these, like I said, was so that I can have them on the side here, my camera angle over here, shooting, and you'll see it sparkling in the background. Just like a little bit nicer than those ugly white dappin dishes and you know, why not? So at Marshall's, Marshall's, Michael's, oh my God, again, forgetting the name, Michael's. At Michael's I did end up finding some flowers. So I ended up going with this bouquet. And the reason I went for this one um, was because it's a full bouquet. So I can put it down on the side and have my clients hover over it. Um, we can both stand up and them stick their hands, uh, that kind of stuff. So I just wanted, like a more white background and green is my favorite color and I do love um, green in flowers. So this might look really good. If it doesn't, I did buy another. And the reason I got these ones were because they were buy one, get one free. So I thought, why not? And if you put them together, they make almost the same size. So this one has some pinks in it. This is like a Christmas one, but it doesn't look that Christmassy to me. So I thought it would work. I picked this one because it's mostly white, but has those blush tones in it, it has some silver. Um, I just thought it was pretty and it might be a nice background alternative. I could maybe switch back and forth depending on what my clients get. I don't know. We'll give it a try. We'll see what, we'll see. I was looking for more realistic flowers, but in the end, this is the background. You don't really see it. So hopefully these will look good. Other things I got in here. Okay. So <laughs> I decided that these would be a great purchase because I have ran out of both of these and these are huge things of them. So what they are are like flakes, like uh, gold foil and silver foil, but they're in this huge package that'll last me forever. So that's nice. So these were only $11 and I'm just gonna open up the silver one. Oh shit, it's already pouring out of here. Okay, Whew. so it's like just a big sheet, <laughs> a big sheet of silver foil. So these are great for doing foil in nails. I know that they're from Michaels. It doesn't matter if they're like, a, it doesn't matter if they're from a nail store or not, they do the same thing. So I got it also in this kind of like, I don't know, uh, it's gold, but it has the copper in it. They did have the plain gold too, but I usually end up going for the gold with the copper in it. So that's why I went with this one when I'm using it on clients. But I do know that they have them there, so if I do have like regret and I want the full gold one, I'll go back and get it. So that's what I got for there, for nail art. More nail art that I got was crystals. So you guys saw me put a few of them in my pack, in my bag. The reason I didn't buy a lot of crystals from Michaels is because I just made a huge order again of a bunch more crystals. I'll do a video if you guys want of that. Let me know down below when I get that in. Um, so I just got a couple here. These really interesting colored ones. I didn't even look at the name of them. What are these? I wonder why they don't say the color on it unless I'm just missing it. But anyways, I thought this color was really unique because I don't have that in my collection. And then I found the smaller version. So I personally like uh, like SS3s, SS5s, that kind of size. And these have SS5s in them. So if I like, if I'm gonna use the big ones, I like to mix in the small ones with it. So that's why I got that. And then you guys saw me pick up this one. I really like this one because it had the three colors in it and they're just kind of unique colors. So you can kind of add 
um, some clear crystals with it to kind of fill in the gaps of the bigger crystals. So that's what I got for the crystals. And then, like I said, I have a big crystal order coming. So I'll show you guys that. And the last thing I ended up getting was paper. I did find a, a book that I wanted to get. Um, luckily, I was like, ooh, I don't know, $29 for paper. <laughs> and then I came across um, a section with $12 paper so I was like yeah let's get that so um in this book they have really really beautiful floral patterns and stuff like that and the reason I went for this one was because it's really girly and pretty and I thought I could definitely get use out of this book for the nail throne Instagram page so I'm trying to do like more pretty product shots and stuff and you know white backgrounds just a little boring so these will be perfect for that and I thought this book would be really good for that so that's why I went with this. So I didn't get everything that I had written down. I really wanted to get like little trays to pour my crystals into to easily pick them up but I do have some like plain square trays coming. They're just not exciting and I really wanted to get like something for my desk that was pretty that I could stick my products on so I can pick them up and move them instead of individually because I do spend a lot of time picking up products and moving them from this desk to that desk to make room. I'm consistently opening acrylic powders, covering the lids, blah blah blah. It would just be easier if I had a tray that I could move them so when I'm doing certain things like I, I have to shut all the lids when I'm filing something. So it's like I sit there, I shut all the lids, I file the smile line, then I have to put the lids back on. I'd rather just be able to move the tray and get started. So that's what I'm looking for. And then I think there was a couple other things I wanted. Let me see. I wrote it down. Realistic flowers, dap and dish, plate for products, crystals to pick up crystals, paper backgrounds. Oh yeah, okay, I just wanted a picture too, but eh, you guys <laughs> don't really care about that. Um, yeah, so that's everything I got. I hope you guys like this video. If you would like to see more like vlog style stuff on my channel where I show you guys what I'm up to or if I'm shopping or stuff like that, let me know and maybe I'll get down to that. I'm kind of getting bored of doing tutorials. So if you guys want to support my channel, please give me a thumbs up, click subscribe, click the bell next to it to be notified when I post and I will see you guys in the next one.